Hey everyone, okay, so today it is the best loose powders of 2017. This is not a big category. I'm very particular about my powders. So we'll start with the first one, we might as well, which is RCMA No Color Powder. You get a whacking three ounces in here. It is massive, it is huge, it suits all skin coloring. There's no pigment or filler. Get this product. You can get it in threes as well, links down there. If you've got more money to spend and you want a nearly identical product, then Laura Mercier's um, translucent powder is really, really good. You get an amazing amount of product. It works every single time. It's not my chosen product for those of you with breakouts because it contains cornstarch, which can feed bacteria, but it's amazing. This is my holy grail for under eye baking. It is um, Souffle de la Cat. I don't know. It is by Yves Saint Laurent, it's the pink powder. It is what I use underneath the eyes or um, along the side of the cheek because I do do that. I do do that, it's, it's true. This powder is amazing. It, if, you want, if you use this powder in a really cool way, you can make it look like you haven't powdered your face. There is luminosity to this powder. It is born this way, um, ethereal setting powder. It is 17 grams of product. It is truly amazing for those of you that want more light reflecting qualities from your powder. Another great powder for underneath the eyes is the Pink Haze by Becca. It's their soft light blurring powder and this is beautiful. And finally, if I just wanna go over the face with a buffing technique, I really like the Bobbi Brown and this is the Retouching Loose Powder. And they are my favorite loose powders. And as I'm speaking to you, I'm putting them back because I don't enjoy seeing mess. It, I find it hard to cope. So I'm putting them back so I know where they are. All links down there. These are my favorite loose powders. Everybody needs a loose powder regardless. Thanks so much. See you soon. Bye-bye.